Hey guys, Dr. Dobson. Uh, we're going to be doing surgical extraction of a 2.6 uh, in this video. Uh, this is the wrong x-ray actually. Old x-ray, this 2.3 ended up abscessing so we sectioned the bridge. But clinically the situation basically looks like this. The 2.4 has a stable endo. The 2.5 has a PFM with some fractured porcelain. The patient didn't want anything done with those. The 2.6 uh, fractured off at the gum line did not have root canal, so it was beginning to cause uh, symptoms and patient wanted it out. So we're going to do that uh, in this video. We're going to uh, infiltrate the area on the buccal and the lingual and then get to work on the tooth and uh, not the type of situation that you can grab with a forceps. So we're going to, we know it's going to be surgical and you can lay a flap and remove buccal bone. Uh, but we're just going to try to um, get it out without a flap. So we're basically just going to section the um, buccal roots from the palatal root. Um, and we're going to take our trough pretty deep so that when we put our um, root tip pick or elevator in, we can really get some good leverage and luxation of the two sections. So we'll finish um, separating all of the dentin that's connecting the sections and take our trough pretty deep and that's looking pretty much good to go there uh, fast forward until we get our root tip pick and then once we're satisfied with our sectioning we'll grab the root tip pick and basically just get it as deep as we can and then um, start uh, elevating the palatal root from the buccal roots and we have reasonable luxation there so we're going to grab a uh, root tip forcep and see if we can't grab the palatal root, which we're fortunately able to do. And uh, if, if we had difficulty, then we could just remove more bone. Uh, we'll do the same thing for the distal buccal root and then the mesial buccal root. You can actually see the, the nerve there. And then um, we did not have enough luxation, or sorry, not enough... Um, purchase to um, grab the root with the forceps. So we're just going to take our root tip pick and see if we can't find uh, some purchase somewhere. And we are unfortunately able to do that on the mesial aspect of the root. So we're just going to fish around and put some elbow grease into it until we are able to elevate the root tip. And that's pretty much that one. We'll give the patient some Advil and Tylenol and give him some gauze and send him home with post-op instructions.